key updates in LXQT2. A significant aspect of the LXQT2 release is its enhanced compatibility with Wayland, the next generation display protocol for a compositor to talk directly with its clients and predecessors like XORG. In light of this, key applications like PCMAN FM QT's desktop module LXQT Runner and LXQT Desktop Notifications are now fully prepared to work under Wayland environments and support the Layer Shell protocol. For users and developers working with both QT5 and QT6, the LXQT team has provided solutions to allow these versions to coexist. This includes broader installation of libraries like libqt xdg, lxqt qt plugin, and libfm qt, which are essential for integration lxqt's features with qt5 based applications. Among the main highlights of lxqt2 is the brand new fancy menu, a slick upgrade to the traditional application menu. It organizes application into categories such as favorites and all applications and includes an improved search function, making it easier and faster for user to find the needed apps. However, Despite the progress, uh, some applications like QTerminal are still catching up. The Terminal Emulator's QT6 port is delayed due to technical challenges, though its QT5 version remains available for use. At the same time, the desktop module in PCMAN FMQT is now fully ready for use with Wayland. Promising a more integrated and smoother desktop experience for users. From now on, the LXQT developers have set their sights on bringing for Wayland integration on their next major release, mm -hmm. LXQT 2.1, continuing the transition and improvement seen in the current release. Although some components like screen grab and certain LXQT panel playing as are not yet fully adapted to Wayland, alternatives are available in making a full LXQT Wayland session feasible for advanced users.